aforementioned players coming into this tournament. Uh, number 10, I believe, in Central Florida. Very solid player. He made a pretty decent run for himself in National Arcadian. I was there. It was a lot of fun. And it looks like we're going to jump right into the match. Here we go on Final Destination. All right. Uh, Sam is trying to charge that charge shot, getting grabbed out of it right away. But obviously, we've got Double Fox, one of the best team compositions in the game. Obviously, comprised of the two best characters in today's meta against um, Jigglypuff, which is controlling a lot of space. Wow, yeah, these wow. factors are causing some havoc. And uh, actually, this is um, actually reminiscent of what Hungrybox and Plup used to do back in the day. Yeah. This is actually a really interesting, uh, almost a Florida, all Florida style of match we've got here. Yeah, with the zoning from them, it's going to be good for keeping the Foxes from using their speed advantage. Because if those Foxes just get to run roughshod with both Samus and Puff having a little bit of a lower base speed, they can sort of pick their engagements. But right now what we're seeing is that they're just controlling so much of the stage and applying pressure with their moves that really we haven't seen that speed advantage now, what a lot of uh, so far. Yeah, what a lot of lower level players don't really realize about doubles is sometimes not moving and holding space is ultra broken. That forward so you'll smash see... did not land where it meant to. <laughs> so if you see um, one of the like, Harriet and or Cobalt going in in the corner and applying a lot of corner pressure, there's a good chance his teammate is just standing there doing nothing, yep. waiting for one of the green team members to jump over or roll through and then just catch an up smash or back air. Yep. So as we see right here, um, the double O tag, and um, was kind of just standing there holding space, but got caught by his teammates back there, but it was unfortunate, but the spacing is going to be imperative in this match. Yeah. Uh, God, big I shine tag opportunity. Oh, no, yeah. didn't it? Yeah, that was a good recovery. Samus, but the... Puff running out of jumps. Uh, yeah, I didn't expect that. Nice tech read from the Fox team. And uh, the Foxes are holding a pretty sizable lead here. As expected, I would say. Yeah, absolutely. But we'll see if it'll widen or if it'll sort of stay steady towards the rest of the game. Oh my god, the space, the tech coverage from the double oh. Fox team from Florida. And, and then, see, the, the empty hops in open space just covering yep. and threatening so much of the out-of-corner options. Absolutely phenomenal play from this double Fox team. Tech read up tilt, that's going to do it. No, not quite. Yeah, you've got a little think bit more percent. That'll do it. Short hop up there. That's a dead puff. You got to stay aware of not just what somebody's doing, but all the things they could be about to do. So things like empty hops and standing in place and moving near your teammate, but not too near. Absolutely. Tomahawks are extremely prominent in the very skilled doubles player. So yeah. expect to see that from Cobalt, Club, and Cal, especially later in the bracket. Oh, rest. I for n that's a pretty decent stock swing, making this a very um, yeah. very doable game. Yes. Yeah, so we can get one more rest into a quick jab reset from their teammate. This is a very doable match. Getting a game bunch game. of percent on Samus right there, though. Excellent drift back from Jasper. And Nair off the ledge, not quite going to do it. Up All right. throw. This is a puff and a dream. Oh, and oh might that's elect real. To oh, oh. going for a little bit of BM. Oh, that might be a quick gimp. But the shine spike off the ledge. Invincible Fox is even better than regular Fox, it turns out. <laughs> Tier negative S. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, what about how it was closer, actually, than I thought it was going to be? Yes. Uh, I'm curious. Uh, I'm assuming the Dreamland pick is going to come. Yeah. I think that the, um, the actually Green Team is holding a lot of space. They're threatening a lot. Of, oh, Battlefield. Interesting. Jeez. I guess they uh, want to contain the Fox a little bit more, not let them turn the game into two 1v1s, because that's what, honestly that's what they're going to lose. And make the edge guards a little bit easier. I oh, think. Of course. Quick tip opportunity for Jasper. Ooh, covering both the Foxes. Fast falling off stage, but she's safe. i 4 holding center stage. Double Foxes with their incredible speed and agility managed to yeah. cross both up. They got split up there and just swarmed over that Samus at the ledge. But, I like uh, Jasper covering her recovery with uh, the down B bombs, and it seems to be uh, tricking up the Foxes a lot. She usually she's only off stage, but she's covering a lot, getting a lot of mileage out of it. Yeah. It's uh, one more thing to keep track of, and the more stuff you're tracking at once in doubles, the more likely someone's going to get away with something you didn't see coming. Jasper with the cross up! Options select! Look at this combo string that she's throwing together. Going deep. Uh, unfortunate shine spike, but I like the trade. That's the stock economics right there. Yeah, Because when you're a high percent floating, you can take down a low percent Fox, especially when the player's better than you. Absolutely. Go yeah. for that. Take that stock trade. Make it easier on yourself. Every day of the week. 
Nice dash attack and the Gimp. Is there an opportunity right for end? Yes, it is. No, Fox with Cloud. Getting back to that ledge on Battlefield. And, uh, charged up smash in the corner there, just in case. Oh, man. Excellent ability from i 4 to cover all that space, but and unfortunately for a, Jasper can't a get to the brief range. moment there, Green Team was actually up. It's uh, no longer up, but it's the first time oh, we've seen it take a real lead all set. Do it. Yeah. Again, the option select from Jasper is incredible. Waiting, it's so similar to Ice Climbers technology where you're splitting up the climbers, waiting for that backup or that lead to come back to help yep. from their teammate, and you're just knocking them back away while they're dashing. Can't really act too much out of dash, unfortunately. Absolutely. Now, right here, Ooh, yeah, nice that coverage from I4N. If they can get, mine. if they can get this edge guard, ah, uh, not quite. All right, and now it's looking looking grim. pretty tough. Oh, but this could be potential. Yes, right. that's one stock down. One quick gimp on a fox, and this is a completely wide open match. Just need Samus to stay alive. And Samus is very good at that as well. Yeah, maybe uh, maybe a quick rest. Have we seen any? Rests? We have. We've seen. Yeah, uh, that's right. Two last game, I yep. believe. I don't think we've seen any this game. Though. There's a lot of quick gifts. i 4 a very fast pub is what I've noticed. Uh, yeah, the, for sure. His movement's phenomenal. That's and that's two up smashes. Yeah, Fox the Cloud will... prevails. Some... And Florida continues their reign of terror in Northeast Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the, bringing the summer up the coast uh, with them. Just it's actually up. very nice weather outside, so I'm, not, yeah. I'm, not, I'm about it. I'm right? About it. Yeah, it's been a real variable spring around here. We'll have we nice days like two this days ago, and then, yeah. rain and fog and all that, all that junk.